Hey guys, I hope you're all doing great staying at home or working from home, you know. I wanted to do this video to share with you some cool advice to stay productive while working from home during this restricted movement order period. I've been working from home, uh, you know, most weekends and some weekdays while writing my book and here are some really good tips and findings for you. Number one, make up your bed. It's important to make up your bed so that start your day with a complete action and don't work on your bed, you know, as I guarantee you, you would be sleeping halfway through and your body should feel that I'm working, not a holiday and let your bed remain as a place that you only rest there. Number two, plan your day. Just sit down and write down what's the five things that are, you need to do by today. So I like to do it on this uh, just yellow sticky notes or I just use my phone notes part. So I just write down what is the five things that I need to get done today. And there you go, I'm good to go, you know. Number three, dress up properly. You know, change your pajamas every morning at getting to the right mindset for work. And if you must take a call, you're ready. Number four, allocate a dedicated space for working. Don't just work everywhere, you know, that you have to keep moving around. Number five, have an agreement with your partner. If both of you are working from home, it's good to have an agreement of how long and when to have lunch or if you have kids around, who take care of them first. Number six, Clean up your surrounding, just get rid of all the dust and vacuum the space as you don't want to work on a messy place. So if you must spend a day cleaning, just do it first. Number seven, get your water bottle and coffee prepared next to you. You may forgot drink water at home, so you don't want to keep going in and out while focusing on your work, right? So I always uh, carry my water here and I also have my uh, coffee with me so I, I don't need to go in and out all the time number eight work with timer I like to work in the blocks of one and a half hour which means one and a half hours focus on working and 30 minutes break number nine avoid turning on your Facebook or LinkedIn or WhatsApp web on your browser because it will ruin your concentration. Number 10, get your ambience perfect. I mean light, temperature and having some greenery around like this indoor uh, house plants that I have at home, you know, so my wife also got another one there. So each one of us basically we have our plants around here and it gives us that greenery feeling and it's really, really good, right? And not to forget your hand sanitizer. Number 11, get some healthy snacks. You know, I like this, uh, this uh, goji berries, you know, and then I also have this uh, organic dry mixed fruit nuts, you know, that I always keep them around, you know, so whenever you feel hungry, you can just get it. Because remember, freeze is just a few steps away and you can really put up weight. Number 12, time for exercise. You know, the issue with working and staying at home is that you might end up laying and sitting all the time. You know, get a scale, measure your weight, and do some exercise at a specific time. You know, I like to, to do it in the morning, so just get away with it. Otherwise, you will find an excuse not to do it. Number 13. Sleep as you are going to work tomorrow. If you don't pay attention to sleeping time, you end up being in a totally different timetable and that will mess up your routine and momentum. Number 14. Learn something new every day. See, growth and learning are not accidental. It's very intentional. So you need to have a plan for every day spending an hour or two to learn something new. I suggest just pick up a book and finish it during this period. Number 15. Enjoy your family. You should never take this opportunity for granted and you must enjoy them as much as you can and don't get angry with them since you all must stay together. 
Thank you so much for watching and share your comments below.